Witcher? Did the villagers hire you? They did, to defend them from monsters, and humans who can be monsters. And you believe me to be such? Are you? Find out for yourself if you dare, or give me Bertram. No one else will get hurt. What did Bertram do to you to warrant vengeance? Mean they didn't mention this bit? Then listen. He came to me a half year back. Said he'd point out who's worth looting in return for a share of the takings. But some time on, the bugger grew greedy. He wanted more. I refused. That's when he set the witch hunters on us. Lost half me men because of him. Now step aside, witcher. This ain't your affair. We want Bertram, no one else. Give my word. I won't get in your way. Do what you gotta. Right decision, Witcher. See? Quick and painless. That's for you. For understanding. Let's go, gents! Come on, Roach. Come on now. Go, go. Slow now. Whoa.
Come on now. Well, look who's here. The witch you with a stick up his ass. What's new? Got a growth on your platter there. You catch some kind of a fiery pox. Could say so. Manners burning, you noticed? That? All right. You know how it is. Feast drags on with plenty of dancing, merrymaking, rough play. <laughs> we got a bit carried away, truth be told. Plain to see. Where's old Geard? Damned if I know. Must be somewhere hereabouts. No! Please! I beg you! Shut your trap! <laughs> Let me go! Leave me be! Shut it! I ain't with you! Drank with you! Fought beside you! But you kill me now! I'm one of you! You might have been. But not no more, you ain't. What's he guilty of? What the fuck's it to you? Not your concern, mate. Whoa. Nerves a little raw? Why? You deaf! Get the fuck out of here, freak! All I want is to know what exactly is going on here. Well, you're not gonna know! Sod off! I'll leave as soon as you tell me. Aren't you a thorny prick up the arse? Ataman said to kill him! Got your answer. Happy? Now piss off! We've work to do. Wait. I know Ogierd wants him dead. Still don't know why, though. Just what the fuck is it to you, anyhow? Nothing, really. Just curious. Cocksucker violated our chivalric code. Just one penalty for that. Death. What is this row? Are you not done with it? My ears wither from the screams. Ah, Geralt. As you've returned, might I assume you've cleared the sewers? Or have you not been... You killed my father! Not I. You lie, Horson! That man killed him. Alone. Unbeknownst to me. Out of fury, for your father refused us hospitality. For this willful violation of the chivalry code, he was summarily executed himself. Anything else I might do for you? Take her away. Now, where were we? Really necessary, that whole show? Ugh. Show? Come now. A man must display some madness from time to time. Helps him feel alive. Dare say you know what I mean. Judging by the mark on your face. Know what this is? I cannot be certain, but I've my suspicions. That's a dangerous man you've chosen to deal with, Witcher. You're immortal. Depends on your understanding of the term. Indeed, I cannot be killed. But it's not at all what folk imagine. Not dying does not mean eternally living your life to the full. So it's a curse. A curse? No. Wouldn't call it that. I'll put it this way. You must be careful what you wish for, lest you wish be granted. For there are consequences. Not sure I follow. You know very little can hurt you. So you take wild risks. Chase extreme sensations. There comes a point you've done it all. 
and all seemed boring and monotonous. The tricks to plough through that moment, go further, reach beyond what's known as possible. Killed the beast in the sewers. Congratulations are in order then. Your reward. You're also welcome to take what you wish from the manor house. If anything's left uncharred, that is. Was it a tough fight? I sliced its gut open, and it turned into a man. You know that would happen? Of course he did. He'd never have dragged you into this elsewise. Go on to old deep. Come to cast aspersions? No. I've come to collect a debt. You know, you first must grant you three requests by proxy. I present to you my champion, Geralt of Rivia. That true? You know the Toad was a cursed prince? He didn't just know. He brought about the curse himself. Did he not mention that bit? Well then, allow me to tell it. Quite the gripping story. Olgierd once loved a beautiful maiden named Iris. Yet, her parents chose to offer her hand to the Crown Prince of Ophir. Olgierd grew to hate the poor sot. At first, he wished to kill him. Then decided this would be too simple. So, instead, he condemned the prince to a base life and a toad's bloated corpus. Yet he grew bored of watching him suffer and decided to end it. By your hand. Remind me, Odin. Who is to fulfill my last three requests? My assistant, Geralt. Then be gone. I don't wish to look at your face any longer than I must. Come. Where to? The stables. My men are preparing to depart. Could have told me the truth about the toad. Having a bit of fun at my expense? I simply wanted the beast dead. I could not know you would respond to the notice. Pure coincidence. Yeah, I must admit, when you, a witcher, answered the call, I thought it right. It's what you lot are trained to do. Might have been able to lift the curse. Perhaps. Perhaps not. Then again, why bother? He was a human being. That bloody Ethereum mutt was no human. His kind does not deserve to live. What he said about the prince, that true? You turn him into a toad? Perhaps. Or perhaps the Afiri Dofa ate something that disagreed with him. You never know with their cuisine. Never heard of food that turns men into monsters. Then perhaps it was something he drank. Hmm. Ah. I cast the curse. Revenge for a deep disappointment. I was another man then. Let rage get the better of me and hollowed the words without ever thinking they could possibly come true. This thing between you and Master Mirror, your quarrel, really rather not get involved. You already are, I fear. He did something for you. Now you've a debt to repay. Am I right? Yes. Well, then you'll not free yourself of him till you've paid it back. But never worry. I shall devise tasks so impossible you will never complete them. Not if you go mad trying. But try your best, and your debt shall be absolved. While I shall live in peace until Master Mira finds another aide de camp. Guess I gotta pop the question.